and now, now we're ready. So, um, Sensei Reese, uh, bring, bring the students in. So please give them a round of applause. Welcome again to all of our students. Now, uh, they're going to be performing in five different groups. They're going to come up uh, one group at a time, and uh, they will receive their, their belts and their awards after uh, they have performed. Uh, now I'd like to make some introductions. So first of all, my wife, Connie. Thank you. I certainly do this without her. And then uh, our son Logan Flaherty in the back back over there. And our uh, Reese Flaherty. And uh, student services staff and technical wizard Jacob Richardson. I believe me, this, this school would not function if we didn't have him in here. So. And then Sensei Wayne Reagan, who uh, will be here in the last 40 years ago. And then we have Karina Zane. Uh, our leader. Okay. Um, and also, a big thank you to all the parents that are helping us with the various things that we that we do here. So we want this to be a fun-filled event for you. Our goal is that you all leave here with sore hands and hoarse voices from all the cheering and clapping that you do. Yeah, he yeah, is. Still one more time. <laughs> Okay, now I just uh, had a couple of words to say here. So first of all, the election is over. Uh, we're still alive, yay. Uh, so far, the country has not broken into a civil war, so far. Um, but what, what would be helpful is if we look at how a martial artist would prepare to handle this type of situation with all the turmoil that's going on in the country. So first of all, it's important to realize that our training is training of mind, body, and spirit. It's not just physical training, but it's mental training. Pre preparing the mind and pre preparing the spirit to be able to handle the turmoil that's going to be happening, or that is happening, or whatever. We don't know what's gonna happen. Um, the, the basic principle is to stay relaxed yet alert. And if you are this way, then you function better, you're lighter, you're quicker, you're more easily adaptable to the things that are gonna happen. The next thing is to believe in yourself. We have this right there in our creed, seek perfection of character, be faithful. Believe in yourself. Trust your knowledge and trust your skills. So trust who you are as a person that you're gonna be able to get through the issues that we have. Uh, and then visualize what you want to have happen. If you want to see, I'm speaking about our country as a whole, if you want to see it moving in a certain direction, visualize what that would be like, and then try to find people that you can work with to make that become a reality. Uh, the other part to it too is that we're not going to solve the um, turmoil in the country unless we attempt to understand the people who oppose us, people who have just different visions or views than, than we have. So it's important that you make an effort to learn about what they're saying and try to understand them as well. Um, so we can get through this. Uh, hopefully the country is gonna be in a much better place uh, 5, 10, 15, 20 years from now. 
Um, but whatever it is, again, just stay relaxed, get alert, try to understand those who oppose you, believe that you can handle what comes your way, uh, visualize what you have, want to have, have happen, and don't quit. Keep doing this. So what, what Master Funakoshi, um, he's one of the masters that's, whose picture is on the front wall in the dojo, what he used to say frequently is keep training. If you keep practicing and you keep developing yourself, then things will work out in the long run. Okay, well, uh, I think it's time for us to uh, start the performances. So, Sensei Reese is going to bring up group number one. Okay. Guys, spread yourselves out. Spread out, spread out, spread out. <laughs> Good enough. Hold yourself in natural stance. Heels together, toes open, hands to your sides and bow. Yoi, get ready. Left leg forward, neck forward stance. Thanks! Step in, punch upper body. Each. Knee. 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 Step back, rising block. Ready. Each. Each. Knee. 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 And return to down block. Step in forward, outside block. Each. Each. Knee. Knee. And step back, down block. Each. Each. Knee. 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 Front snap kick step forward. H. H. B. B. Turn. Front snap kick upper body step forward. H. B. Turn. Yame. And back. Let's is this was loud, right? Yes, and we want it loud. Uh, now, loudness has to, has to be modified over the years as you develop, but the first thing that the child has to develop is confidence in themselves. And you develop confidence by the way you stand, the way you hold yourself, the way you use your voice. So if we teach them how to stand straight and tall, to, to look out at eye level, and to have a big voice. So that's what we're teaching them here. Now, later on, we'll also teach them that a soft voice is also necessary. And, right, um, and it's, it's not the loud voice that we're gonna want in, we're gonna want a powerful voice. The difference between loud and powerful. Um, okay, well I think it's time to give out the, the belts here. So, so, first person to come up is Mateo Castro. Okay, next up is Happy Kanuka. And next is Kassan Holson. Henry Flahai. Enoch Perez. And then we have three additional students who are up here performing, and for one reason or another, they were not taking the exam. So let's have Sophia uh, Gleason come forward, Cooper, and Hudson. Face the front, and all of you bow. Bow. Okay, thank you very much. Okay. Hold your 
hold yourself in natural stance. Heels together, toes open, hands to your sides and bow. Your left leg forward, PI. Hey! Ah! Step in, punch upper body. Each. Knee. Stepping back, rising block. Each. Knee. Return it down block. Stepping forward, outside block. Each. PI. Step back, down block. Each. PI. Arms to your sides. Front snap kick. Each. PI. Turn. Front snap kick, upper body. Each. PI. Turn. Yame. Heels together, toes open. Stop. Earning his first yellow belt. <laughs> then Coda Christofferson. Earning her first yellow belt. Morgan Riley. Earning his yellow belt. On Lee, earning her yellow belt. <laughs> Rowan Riley, earning his yellow belt. <laughs> Ani Tuidraka, earning a tip strike, step three. Johnny Giroux, earning a tip strike for step three. <laughs> Stella Gutierrez, earning her orange belt, step four. <laughs> Manuela Stasio, earning step five, a tip strike on her orange belt. And we have a few other people who, um, um, uh, we're, for one reason or another, we're not able to take the test. So would all of you please come forward? So Rebecca Riley, um, Christopher, and Joanne, and Mary DeCastro. Yeah. Okay, so first up, first up is Avery Flynn, earning her blue belt, step nine. 
And Emilio Valencia, also earning his blue belt, step nine. And Georgie Jasmine, earning step 11, a hip strike. One step away from his purple belt. All right, thank you very much. Okay, and very good. All right, guys. Wow. Announce the name of the kata. Student up is Carlos Pareco, earning step 10, a tip strike. earning her purple belt. Knee, side, 
Chi. Go. Row. Teach. Up. Help. Chu. E. Yep. Yummy. Yum. And back. Okay, so uh, first up is Jonathan Rushing, step 17. <laughs> A tip strike. <laughs> Keiko Haynes, step nineteen, a tip strike. And 
last stop but not least, Sensei Wayne Reagan received his fifth degree. <laughs> So that, that concludes our awards. We're now going to.